here early. Sorry about that. Nah, it's fine. What's up? Did you get it? Cliff Dynamite and the Brain Looters 4. Oh my god, you're amazing. How'd you find it? Uh, I downloaded it from some Russian toy website. I can't wait to see it. Well, don't just stand there. Come in. Feel free. There is nobody home. Can I get you anything? A glass of water? Have you seen the other movies? Uh, yeah, sure. Which one's your favorite? I think I like them all equally. I hated the second one. The whole part of the submarine was ridiculous. Yeah, I didn't like that part either. Busted, there's no submarine. I was testing you. You didn't see any Cliff Dynamite movies, did you? Um, no. Is that a problem? Nah, there's no continuity whatsoever in those plot lines anyway. Namaste. Of course not. Good, press play. What are we gonna do? Being stuck without ammo fighting zombies isn't a situation I'd like to be in. It's like watching a movie without popcorn. Wait, what? I said, 
that fighting zombies without ammo is like watching a movie <clears throat> without popcorn. Not a situation a man wants to be in. Hey, should we get some popcorn? Yeah, there's some in the cupboard left to the sink. <clears throat> you know, I'm not really good at uh, unfamiliar microwaves. You gotta get the timing just right, and I always bring a whole bag. Maybe it's best if you do it. Okay, noob. Sit back and watch the master go to work. I'll show you how it's done. Dude, what are you waiting for? I don't have all day. Think I like running around in the frickin' sun with a bunch of zombies up my oil? Just go for it. What are you so scared of? No way. I didn't know she wants me to. Dude, of course she wants you to. You tell her. Well, I guess. Just go for it, sweetie. What's the worst that could happen? If she isn't ready, she'll tell you politely and that's it. And she'll get mad. And I'll be all weird. And she'll tell everybody how much of a loser I am. And she'll never speak to me again. Fried free whole eggs, kid. Get it together. She invited you home when her parents are out. Asked you to bring a movie about the manliest man. Oozing with pantalone dropping machismo to inspire your sorry face. She sits up next to you on the couch, up in your business. What more do you want? Yo, Chloe, Dean here wants to kiss you. You shut up, little racist file. What? Did you say something? Uh, nothing. Don't start without me. Of course I won't. Stop here for the night. We should be safe. Are you sure? We're like right in the middle of an open field. Don't worry, baby. We're in the middle of a minefield that only I know the safe route in and out of. So come here. Lay your head on my manly chest. And let's get some rest. You were really brave today. You might have even saved my life there a couple of times. believe this. Only seven kernels left unpopped out of the whole bag. And it's cooked exactly right. I'm the absolute queen of microwave popcorn. No, isn't this just perfect? You're perfect. Huh? What? I mean, uh, impressive indeed. Dean, watch out! Oh, I'm so sorry. What's up, man? You're acting weird. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to ruin things like I just did. I think I should just probably go. I'll let you watch the movie without me. 
No, it's all good. I already know how it ends. I've read all the comic books. So why did you want to see it? I honestly don't care that much. I just thought it'd be nice if we could watch something together. I thought so too, but then I ruined everything. No, you didn't. I did. I'm just too distracted to watch a movie right now. What's up? Forget about it. You won't get it. But maybe I will. Well, what are you two clowns waiting for? I'm here busting my butt fighting zombies all day so that you two juveniles can... <laughs>